the question is, are you happy? And if you're not happy, what's holding you back? What, what, what do you think that's the source of your lack of happiness? What is it that you think, if we're to change, it will make things different for you, that you would be happy? What's the purpose of your life? We gotta look at what makes you really do what you do. You need to find something that's eternal inside of yourself. That no matter what changes on the surface, this part of you does not change. It's the part you come back to, the part that guides you, the part that really makes you fulfilled. Most of us in life are so afraid something's going to happen that we can't control, and therefore we're going to get pain, that we try to avoid those things we can't control. We try to shape our lives, where we spend our time, who we spend our time with, what we do by environments that we feel really comfortable in, where we feel like we're really in control in them. But what that does is it limits the shape and quality of our lives. You know, so many times we set goals or we have dreams or we have plans and we work our tail off and it doesn't come out the way we want. And a lot of people come out of those situations disillusioned or angry or resentful or frustrated. They look for someone to blame. But you know, sometimes I really truly believe that not getting your goal is part of the design causing you to dig inside and discover more of yourself, to really begin to use your real capacity as a human being, those traits that are within you that only expand when they're challenged. How do you live in a world where suddenly something can happen, it could take away your whole business, or you know, a storm could come and take away your home, or, or some calamity could happen to your personal family, or a disease could hit, or, or someone could die? How do you deal with all that? And the answer is, you have to know the one thing you can control is not events. What you control is what things mean to you. How much time you really waste? For real. How much of our brains are we really going to use? So I don't care if you're a, you're a star athlete, I don't care if you're a billionaire, I don't care if you're a CEO of one of the most important companies, I don't care if you're an entertainer, like I don't care who you are. We all have problems. Stop letting the problems consume you. Problems are a part of life. There are two types of people in the world. I'll tell you exactly who they are. You have people on one side who have reasons. They tell you all the fucking reasons why they can't become successful, why they can't get what they want in life. The question is, what are you going to do with your time? What drives you? I want you to focus on your dreams. Nobody ain't got to convince me of what I do. I want you to focus on your goal. I do what I do because I do what I do. I want you to focus on your solution. Because I'm built from something. And man didn't create it. I want you to focus on that dream life that you have. If you put as much time into working on winning as you put into thinking about losing, you already be a champion.